As the pandemic drags on, many of us are still helping older family members with their technology. One local student set out to do just that and ended up creating a whole network that has never been more important until now. WPTV News Channel 5 Stephanie Susskind introduces us to the South Florida Tech for Seniors, where the students become the teachers. I mean, if you want to place a value on it, you can't. You really can't. Jerry and Joan Balin haven't met Sam Friedman in person, but they are certainly connected. We have six granddaughters. We have no grandsons, so we'll adopt Sam. <laughs> the Suncoast High School junior knew there was a need to help seniors with technology, but never could have predicted a pandemic taking that to a new level. What was coming slowly but surely became an avalanche of people trying to get connected online and use Zoom and use video call because all of a sudden there was no alternative. Sam started South Florida Tech for Seniors last year, a nonprofit offering free tech support for those who need a little guidance. Earlier this year, he was forced to pivot from in-person sessions to phone calls, instructional videos, and Zooming to learn Zoom. I mean, my favorite thing is to see seniors get on Zoom or FaceTime for the first time, and you finally see their face and you finally see connected. There's definitely a, a light bulb moment there. For Jerry and Joan, it helped them reconnect with family across the country during an isolating time. And every three months, we're going to have a family meeting, which would never have occurred, really, had not been with Zoom. And they are grateful for someone like Sam walking them through it, even from a distance. But the whole idea of being able to do what we're doing now is really a phenomenon. It really is. Stephanie Suskind, WPTV News Channel 5.